This is Breaking News Now from today's TMJ4. That breaking news, we just found out the FBI is involved in the Beaver Dam apartment explosion from yesterday. And Kristen Byrne joins us live now from the scene. Some new information coming to you, Kristen. What can you tell us? Yeah, well, I just left a news conference where we found out from the Beaver Dam police chief that the explosion that happened inside one of these units behind me at the Village Glen apartment complex is not the result of a meth lab. Instead, it's something a lot more serious. We found out that the chemicals police discovered inside one of these units are explosive. During a news conference, the chief called them, quote, sensitive and unstable, but he didn't say what those chemicals are. Beaver Dam police also found bomb-making devices inside the apartment unit and the body of a 28 year old man. That body is still inside the unit. So logistically, we have to plan for it, is to figure out how we're going to get in there because we need to keep all those that go in there safe. And police have not identified uh, the body of that man who died inside the unit. And they can't say for sure if that body is indeed the man who rented the actual apartment unit. A handful of residents still remain displaced. Uh, they lived in that same building where the blast went off. It's unclear when they'll be able to get back. But from what we're hearing, that building is not structurally safe. Live in Beaver Dam, Kristen Byrne, today's TMJ4. All right, Kristen, appreciate the updates, and obviously she's going to be there through the day, and we'll bring us another update on any other information we learn in our next newscast at 4 o'clock.